Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Fashion Nova Curve Haul and I'm pretty proud of this one. I think I did pretty good. I just tried everything on, I'm like, damn, I picked some winners. And it's also very Jersey of me. So we'll get right into it. Okay, the first item is my favorite. It's this sparkly dress. So it's a long sleeved, kind of like t-shirt style dress that then has this belt you can tie on. So this is the dress that I'm gonna compare the Anthropology version to. I first saw the Anthropology version on Rosie Beam's story. Um, and then I saw that they had this on Fashion Nova. I'm like, okay, I'll just buy this one. And then I was at Anthropology. I'm like, let me get it for the comparison. Um, I love this so much. I have yet to even try on the Anthropology version, but I really like this so far. So I'm very curious to do the comparison video, which should be coming out probably this weekend. Um, so I really like this. It's lined. It has the small sequins. It has elasticity along the, um, I never know what this is, the wrist. Um, to give you a little bit of a puff sleeve, nothing too crazy dramatic. Something I really love about the belt is that it has the velvet part, but then it kind of transitions back into the sequins at a point. So I think that's a really cute detail. So it's going to give you that velvet belt along your waist, but then the tie is going to be the sequins again. So I think that's a really, really cute detail. I love how this fits. At first I put it on without the belt and it was just like, you know, a shirt dress and I kind of, you know, I looked like a club ghost. Kind of ghostly, but it's sparkly. So it's like, I'm haunting your dreams, but I died at the club. But once the belt was on, it just tied everything together so well. I was a little nervous about this being too poofy once the belt was on, but Honestly, it sat on me so nicely. I am going to the Jonas Brothers again this Saturday, and I think this is what I'm gonna wear. I'm so pumped to wear this. So this is perfect for holidays coming up, Christmas, Christmas parties, New Year's, New Year's parties, my birthday, we'll see. But I'm very happy I have this. This one is a little bit more pricey on the Fashion Nova website, but they always run really good promos. Also, we have the holiday sale season coming up. I also have my own promo code if you wanna use that. So there are chances to get this cheaper than what it's going for. I got this in a 2X. I think it fits perfectly. Um, there's a little bit of like a nice cascade at the bottom. Oh, just look at that shimmer. Oh. I love this so much, so I'm very, very happy I got this. And stay tuned, sometime in the next seven days, I will be doing a comparison video of this dress and it's like sister dupe from Anthropology. Okay, so the next outfit, like together, is very New Jersey of me. Um, I frequently say that cheetah print is the state flag of New Jersey and I'm not lying. So I saw this shirt and it's like, not something I would usually pick up, but put it together with these like faux leather leggings. I was like, that's a look. And I think I saw it on the website too. Um, so just a long sleeve top. Again, you have the elasticity on the wrist. So a little bit, not a balloon sleeve, but there is gonna be a little bit of a more dramatic effect. Um, this has a pretty open back and then you can tie around the neck. This is a cascading like waterfall high low, like a really pretty, um, cascade to it. It's not very blunt. It's going to nicely flow off your body and the front part is long enough. I hate when I have a high low and the high is very high. So I think it has a really good balance to it. Something I do have to get used to though is there's a seam right below the bust and I'm just like not used to that feeling, you know? So that's something I have to get used to. It wasn't uncomfortable, but not a lot of my clothing items that I wear day to day have that. So it's just a weird feeling to have that seam, especially like all the way around the back. So again, this is not something I would typically buy, but I tried it out to experiment and I'm very happy I did. I love the way this looks, um, especially with the leggings that I got to wear with it. But I also think this would wear really well with jeans or just like plain black ponty pants. So this is a good, just like everyday option. A little Peg Bundy now that I'm looking at it, but I love um, the draping of this top. So I got it to go along with these. Oh, this is in a 2X. Um, I got it to go along with these pleather leggings. I've been wanting to try Fashion Nova leggings and pleather leggings, so why not try Fashion Nova pleather leggings? Um, and I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I The only other pair of like full pleather leggings I had was 10 years ago and they were from Walmart and I literally like squat down to get something and they burst. So. These, 
I did the squat test in these. These survived the squat test. Waistband stayed where it was throughout the squat. So I'm pretty happy about that. They're lined so they don't have the pleatherness on the out, um, inside too. These also are pretty quiet. I've seen other people get pleather leggings and it's like that swish um, sound. I walked around a little bit, nothing noticeable. So I was happy about that. So these I also got in a 2X and I think they fit pretty well. So I'm excited to try more outfits with these. I think it'll like jazz up something that, you know, if you were just doing leggings and a top, this like kind of elevates it a little bit. There's also a little slit right on the front ankle you know, little slit action. I didn't even notice that until I was like looking down. I was like, oh, okay. So a nice little added detail. So I'm happy I got to try these because they actually worked out pretty well. Okay, so that was a pretty Jersey going out outfit. The next one is a pretty Jersey staying in outfit and it's an outfit I had back in high school. So I guess this trend is coming back because I got a velour tracksuit. Um, Back in the day, like when I was in high school, Juicy Couture sweatsuits were the shit, and I had one. I don't know how my parents swung that. I think it was from an outlet, but I did have one Juicy Couture sweatsuit, and it was actually really comfy, and I still own the pants because the pants are so comfy. So it's been like 13 years, and I still have those pants. Um, so when I saw this on the Fashion Nova website, mind you, they have a bunch of colors, but I went for maroon because I'm a whore for maroon. Um, I was like, I gotta get this, just for like loungewear purposes. Um, I have to get the sweatsuit, like, you know, the nostalgia. So I got the whole sweatsuit in a 1X. I think the pants fit amazingly and the top fits as well, but I wish I could have gotten the 1X in the pants and a 2X up top. Um, the pants, you know, standard velour tracksuit pants. We have pockets, there's a drawstring, really soft, they're not velour on the inside. So regular sweatpants on the inside. And then they do have um, kind of a bit of a jogger effect. They come in again at the ankles. Nothing crazy. You don't, you're not going to look like MC Hammer. These fit really, um, they taper to my leg and I like that. I didn't want them to be big and baggy. Um, but I guess you could size up if you wanted to. So as always, I will leave my measurements down below. So I'm happy I got the one in the bottoms and then the top, I feel it fit really well. I was wearing it zipped. It wasn't uncomfortable. I wasn't busting out of it. It didn't feel tight along the back, but I just feel um, for maybe length purposes and just a little bit of just like letting me out um, throughout the body. A 2X would have been even better, but I'm still gonna wear the 1X. It fits just fine. But since my channel is all about helping you guys shop, um, I would recommend maybe sizing up. Um, and if you're gonna size up, you're gonna get the whole set in a size up, but you can always, you know, drawstring the pants accordingly. And I think it'll feel fine throughout the leg. But I also feel like I can wear these separately because I can wear this, you know, post gym or just open with jeans. And then this I can wear around the house with like a black t-shirt and you're fine. Um, but I just think this is a cute like travel day outfit, lounging around the house outfit, running to the grocery store. I, I do kind of like the thought of wearing them together. So this was definitely a flashback to high school. Um, but I think these are coming back in style, but they're very comfy. Um, so I'll be wearing these a lot. And then finally, nothing crazy, just a sweater dress. And this is also something they had in a bunch of colors, but I went for this olive green. I think it's really good for this time of year. Like one of those like late fall, wintry kind of colors and green usually looks good with the red hair. So I got this in a 1X. Um, again, I would probably size up. This is pretty form fitting, but I liked how it looked. I didn't want to be overly baggy, but I do like that look in some instances. So this is cut for a dress. It's not a big sweater that you can wear as a dress. This is a full on dress. So the length is perfect. I had um, tights on underneath. I really liked how that all looked, came together really nicely. And again, a little bit more form fitting, but that's kind of the look I was going for. I do also appreciate the like Ariana Grande, big sweater kind of look but I wanted a true sweater dress. I think adding a belt to this would be really cute. And I think this will be good for Thanksgiving. I was just thinking like, if you're wearing jeans on Thanksgiving, you are a clown. No, we need to breathe. We're gonna be stuffing ourselves. We need the room to grow. And I think a sweater dress is the perfect option for a Thanksgiving um, or just holiday party in general kind of thing. So you're not constricted. You can just kind of like 
fill it out. <laughs> so I just think this is really cute. I know sweater dresses um, are really popular this time of year, so I wanted to show you a sweater dress option. Okay, so that was my Fashion Nova Curve haul. We had cheetah print, we had sequins, we had a tracksuit. It's very New Jersey of me, I think. Um, but all things, like they're all weird separately, but like pulled together, I'm like, I think I did pretty good in this haul. It's all things I will wear. I think I did like five out of five or however many items I got. Um, as always, my measurements will be down below. All the items will be linked down below. And my, I was gonna say my sizes, but that, I already said that. My discount code is down below. So other than the sequin dress, everything else is really affordable, under $30. And they always run promo and I have my own promo code. So I will leave that down below. I believe it's Shannon Miller. We'll see. I don't remember these things. I should, um, but I will leave my promo code down below if you wanna shop. And a lot of the things were available in different colors. So, you know, there's lots of options. So look out for my comparison video. We're gonna do like high end versus fast fashion with that sparkly dress. And I love that sparkly dress. So you'll be seeing me wearing that at the Jonas Bros concert on Saturday. And I'll probably be really annoying on my Instagram stories. Um, but um, yeah, I have that video coming up. A lot of inside the dressing rooms, a lot more hauls and maybe some vlogs as well. We'll see. Yes. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.